as of now, we do know that this virus can be spread from human to human. We are still trying to gather more information to have a more precise conclusions about how this virus behaves, including the incubation period. One of the common symptoms is mainly respiratory tract infections. So things like fever, cough, sore throat will be a very common presenting symptoms. But when the disease progresses, many of them may develop pneumonia and that will be the time they will develop breathlessness. The questions on whether or not a surgical mask is, is good enough, uh, I would say that you know, if you do feel unwell, uh, you need to, uh, you have cough or you have respiratory symptoms, it is good for you to put on a surgical mask if you need to mingle around uh, with uh, other people. And don't forget that you should also wash your hand very frequently so that when you touch any subjects, you don't contaminate that and potentially that can be a source of transmission. So for the Singaporeans who need to travel overseas, it will be very important for them to look out for information, local information as well as information at destination. It's important for the travellers to first study the situations on the place where they would like to visit uh, and also uh, prepare themselves uh, in terms of good personal hygiene, uh, avoid crowded area, uh, avoid coming into contact with a live animal. It is the individual responsibility of your own health as well as the individual's responsibility to be able to protect the community as well. If you do travel to the area potentially affected, do monitor our own uh, temperature and monitor our own symptoms. Uh, if you feel unwell, it will be good for you to seek medical treatment as early as possible.